Andy, a two-all draw with Wildstone this afternoon. What's your thoughts on the game? Well, uh, I think it's the old cliche of the game two halves, wasn't it? I mean, we, we could have started any worse. We gifted them a couple of goals, which you know baffled me, really. We made some bad decisions and, and people, you know, you know, just didn't did win the first ball and then we didn't win the second ball. Um, so it was, you know, it was a, a poor start from us. So second half, though, you know, I think there's only one team going to win it. Um, but you can't give teams two goal starts at any level, any team. Um, but we, the one thing I'm really chuffed about, uh, we've got a team with a bit of fight. Because uh, if you ain't got a team with fight, you're struggling before you even start. So they showed that. So that's a real positive uh, from my point of view. As you say, it was a game of two halves, but do you see today as a point earned or two dropped? Uh, well, listen, we, we, we've got a target, so uh, it's a point closer to the target we've given ourselves. Um, and and that's, all, that's all we can do. You know, we, we, we've, got a, we, we, we've got a target we've got to hit. We know that in-house, what we've got to do. So it's a, it's, a, it's a point closer to that. Disappointed, of course. But um, it just goes to show there ain't no need, there's no easy you know, results in this league or teams in this league. Um, and you've got to give a bit of credit to them, you know, they, they sort of played with a bit of freedom and, uh, and had nothing to lose uh, in their mind. So, uh, you know, we kind of played into their trap a little bit first half. And let's talk about the goals, of course. Byron Webster getting the first of them. It was an excellent corner, wasn't it, from Liam Vincent? And he almost scored uh, the same goal a few minutes ago, but did on the second attempt. Yeah, I mean, the, the delivery was fantastic. And, uh, you know, Byron put in was, was just what we needed at that point of the game, to be honest. Um, so, see, so yeah, the goals, the goals, you know, were good, and we, and we, and we had a few chances that you know we probably should have three or four goals. Let's be honest. Um, but today we didn't get them. Um, but you know, if I've looked at the last few games, uh, and I don't remember us having that many chances. So that's a plus as well. You know, um, Cheeks had three or four chances, and, and that's what I wanted to have three or four chances a game, not just one. And uh, he took that today, so that's good. It was a great start to the second half, wasn't it? I think there were four, three or four chances within the first five minutes. And of course, it did take a little bit longer, but Michael Cheek pulling it back to two, a man that's in great form this season. Yeah, he's, uh, yeah he, he needed that as well, I think, for him, because I think he puts himself in a bit too much pressure. Uh, you know, it's probably the burden's been on his shoulders a little bit, and, and one or two others need to chip in with goals. Um, but yeah, it was a good start. I mean, second half, we, I, I couldn't see us losing it. I actually, you know, I thought we were just going to go on and win it. but. A fair play to them. They they threw everything in the box, and, and we did, and and it just didn't fall for us uh, today. But I'm I'm more than happy. You know, if we take that second half performance forward, uh, I think uh, you, you would be all right. And credit has to go, I guess, to Liam Vincent, a first National League start for him. What did you make of his performance today? He's excellent. I mean, I think I think him and uh, the other boy half. I thought they were excellent. I thought it was a real tonic we needed. Um, you know. <laughs> Some of the people, you know, the staff are saying maybe he should be coming off and he's resting, but I think he could run all day. He's excellent. I mean, fair play to him. He's a real, uh, a real talent, and um, you know, it's nice to see these talents come through the club and and, and, and being played. I'm sure, yeah. And and like I say, Arthur was excellent as well. The other side. And of course, attention now turns to the second of our two Easter fixtures: a trip <laughs> to Stockport County on Monday in front of the TV cameras. Looking forward to it. Not if we play like that first half. I'm not. I've got to be honest. But yeah, it's of course. Yeah, I mean, we're going to uh, we're going to go there. And we're again, we know what our our target is and our agenda is. Um, and listen, I, I've worked for these guys with these guys for three days, so I'm not going to suddenly create a miracle. We've got to make that really clear. But they're buying into what we're saying. Uh, there was flashes of it out there. Um, so we've just got to keep, you know, quick turnaround. So we've just got to try and keep grinding out results and, and performances. Second half was a good performance, you know. So that, you know, I'm happy with that. Well, Andy, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you.